Hello and welcome to my channel. In this tutorial I will show you the easiest way to shade hair in Adobe Illustrator. For the whole process we will use the pencil tool and if you also have a graphic tablet, then everything will go much easier. So, we will select pencil tool and first we will make a light in the upper part of the hair. We will go similarly with the hair and color everything white using the eyedropper tool or selecting the color from the color palette. Then we will select both the newly created shape and the rest of the hair, we will go to shape builder tool and we will delete the outer part by pressing alt and left click. We will change the transparency on overlay and we will play with the opacity depending on the desire. I chose 40%. Then we will create another light that will be found in the center of the hair. We will also follow the strands of hair and take over the color of the top using the eyedropper tool. Then we will lower the opacity to 20%. At the bottom we will create a shadow and use the pencil tool again. After creating the shadow, we will color it black and delete the part we don't need, using Shape Builder tool. Then we will change the opacity to 15%. Next, we will create another light on the center, smaller, in the middle of the other one, also using the pencil tool. We will color this one the same as the other one using the eyedropper tool. Then we will create another shadow at the bottom of the hair but this time it will be much smaller and closer to the edge. This will take the color of the one below it. We will do the same in the upper part. We will create a second light very close to the top of the hair and color it similarly to the one below it.
Then we will create a shadow under the hair that will be seen on the surface of the face. We will create it all with pencil tool and then we will erase the unwanted part. Finally, we will apply a linear gradient of two points on the surface of the hair. At the bottom will be the desired color and at the top will be a lighter shade of the same color. Thank you for watching this tutorial and I hope you liked it. Don't forget to press the subscribe button. In this way I will know that you appreciate my work and I will continue to make interesting tutorials for you.